Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to do the what's in my sin bin tag. So I was tagged by the lovely Kelly again on Kelly's Slimming World journey. So thank you so much Kelly um, for tagging me. I'm really excited to show um, to share with you um, my sin treats. Okay, so I don't necessarily have like a sin um, basket or bin, um, but in the last um, sort of week or so, I was given this basket. So I've just put, tried to put everything in here just for you to um, see and make it easier really for me to, um, to grab them. So yeah, they're just in various places, um, you know, in the cupboards. Perhaps I might just keep them all in there. Maybe, I don't know. Um, but yeah, so I am going to show you some um, and share with you some frozen things first, just so that I can put them back in the freezer before they defrost. Now, they are behind me. I should have thought about this, but never mind. Okay, so the first thing that I want to show you that I really, really enjoy um, is the mini Viennas from Iceland. These are three sins a stick and they're really, really good. So you can see that's the, how big the ice cream is. And um, they're really, really decent, uh, decent size. Sorry, I can't speak this morning. Um, and they are three sins each. So I really, really enjoy these when I can get them um, because sometimes, um, you know, my Iceland doesn't have them. But yeah, they're pound fifty and it's a pack of five and really really worth the sins in my opinion so if you see these when you're out um you know give it a go they've got chocolate they've got ice cream really really good um the next thing which is also frozen um is the infamous halo top i've not tried this yet um, but i am going to be um the only flavor that was left in my tesco's when i went was the chocolate um, so yeah, I'm excited to try this because I've seen so many people talk about it, but I want to get some of the other flavours as well. Um, so sin wise on this one, on the app for a hundred and, where are we, 118 mils, not grams, mils, is three and a half sins. I have double checked all of this information, um, but please, you know, feel free to check um, the app for sin values yourself just to protect your weight loss. But I have checked these, um, you know, I checked them this morning before I filmed this video. So yeah, for 118 mils of this, you can um, spend three and a half sins. So what I would probably do um, <clears throat> is um, what I did with the Oppo ice cream. I took it out of I took it out of the whole tub weighed the whole thing and then I sort of just had it in half um because I know it sounds a bit greedy but for me like a couple of scoops wouldn't do it so um I would be more than happy to spend I think like going by the calorie rule on that one it's about 16 cents for the whole tub which is really really good for an ice cream so I'd be more than happy to spend eight cents on half a tub of ice cream because it's one of my favorite things um i would be satisfied with half um a tub and then you know half in in another sitting so yeah those are the first two things i'm just gonna go and quickly put them back in the freezer just so they don't um defrost on me so i'll be back okay so i am back so let's carry on um so the next thing is golden syrup you can see there um i have this on my breakfast mostly um my overnight breakfast is two and a half cents per level tablespoon so you will need a sort of measuring spoon um but i really really enjoy that and a tablespoon is enough so i have it on my overnight breakfast like um overnight scambran or overnight grape nuts and i find that you know it's a really um really good accompaniment to that um you know it's really really sweet and gloopy and it feels like a real treat you know you could put it on anything you could put it on the ice cream you could put it on um you could put it on a pudding you could put it on anything really um mix it into things but yeah that's another good thing that i spend my sins on um so yeah phone syrup so next 
Um, next, I like to spend my sins on hot drinks. Um, so this one is the Salted Caramel Mocha. Um, I've only got one left of these. Um, I also had Before Christmas Toffee Nut Latte. Um, they come in little sachets like this. They're quite um, a decent size. They go really nice and frothy and creamy. And they're four sins. So this one, this one, and the Toffee Nut Latte, they were both four sins. I'm not sure about, um, you know, other variations but I'm sure they wouldn't be too much different but <clears throat> I really like those with um in the evening I haven't got any in sort of stock at the moment um in stock <laughs> I haven't got any here in the house at the moment but I really like the um rich tea fingers which are one sin each um I'll have a look to see if I can find a photo somewhere um if I can I'll insert a photo um around about here um and i have those you know sometimes when i've got a lot of sins left you know i can have a load of those biscuits and one of those and it feels like a really nice treat so yeah that's another thing so staying with um hot drinks i also enjoy the options hot chocolates so i've got a i've got three different flavors here i've got two of the um belgian hot um ben, uh, belgian chocolate these are two sins each i've got two of those i've got the salted caramel this one is one and a half sins and this for the whole sachet and this one is the um fudge highlights this one is but it's also two sins they're really really good um i like them like i said just as a hot drink with some really low sin biscuits um and i'm just gonna try and find something that i put at the bottom um, yeah, I like them with, I'm so sorry about the noise guys, um, yeah like I said I like them with biscuits as a hot drink or you can use them, you can put them into cork, I do that quite often and make a pudding sort of like a chocolate mousse, um, I've also made milkshakes with, with them, um, not for myself but for my husband I've got an Aero Latte Wizza or whisker um so you know there's lots of different things that you can do with them so i recently got my order so this was um i ordered a while ago and it was coming from china i think it took ages but it was only something like 80p um what i'm going to do with these once i've got some um, muller lights or some free yogurt i'm going to mix that with the options and then put it into these molds and then put it into the freezer so they freeze like little sweets. Um, I've seen these on Instagram, on Facebook, um, and you know I don't know if I'm gonna like it, but I'm gonna give it a go because then this whole thing would be um, two cents or however much of the mixture that you use. So that's another thing that I'm looking forward to trying. So yeah, you know the hot chocolates um, powders are really quite versatile. And I really enjoy them. So that's that. What have we got next? So next, I'll do these. <laughs> so these are Cheetos. They are the 13 gram pack. And these ones are three and a half sins. So they are quite small, um, but they're quite rich. So there you can see that, you know, they're about the size of my hand. But, you know, and they are quite full. So, like I said, these are the 13 gram multi multi pack. Um, and they are three and a half sins. They are quite rich. I love cheese. So, you know, for me, like one pack, it would satisfy me, but they are quite low. So yeah, they're really good. I always have some kind of um, low sin crisps in the house somewhere. Um, and these are just the ones that I happen to have at the moment. So they're really good. Then I also have the Aldi Pea Snacks. These are red Thai curry flavour. They are four sins. Um, you can get them in lots of different flavours. Um, and they're just something, they taste a bit like chipsticks. I don't know if anyone remembers those from like years ago. Um, the salt and vinegar sort of long crisps. That's what they taste a bit like. Um, but they are four cents a bag and you know it's quite quite a big bag there. So yeah, they're really good. You know, you can have them um, on the side of a meal or you know just to snack on if you want something and you want a bag of crisps, you can go to these. So yeah, they're really good as well. <clears throat> 
So what have we got next? So next I've got the um, Frutella Sugar Free Folk fruit foams um, I've not tried these yet but I am going to you can have 20 grams of the packet for two sins or it's eight sins for the whole bag um, so you know they're quite you know they, they, there's quite a lot in there you know and if you wanted to use um, if you wanted to use eight sins um, and you know if you're watching a film or going to the cinema or something like that then these could be really good like I said I don't know what they taste like yet but they're probably nice so I'm gonna give those a go um yeah so that's another thing then we also have the fiber one chocolate fudge brownies these are really nice they're quite rich and chocolatey and like really cakey um I find that they really give a that if I'm fancying cake I can have one of these and they're really really good they are four sins they also do a salted caramel and a lemon drizzle flavour, which are all four sins as well. And they are, or they were on offer in Asda for £1.25, I think it was. So, yeah, really, really good. Next, we have um, the Aeros. I love these. These are one of my favourites. And they are the 27 gram bar. Um, these ones are seven and a half cents for the bar. Um, they they are really, I know it's chocolate, but they are really, really chocolatey. Um, and I will just have these as they are, as a chocolate bar. Um, or I have had them sort of crumbled up over a pudding and it just gives that you know what I did when the other other night I think it was and um I did quark with the options hot chocolate and um put that in the bottom and then crumbled like a fiber one bar and crumbled the arrow over the top as well and it was really really good so yeah you know that's another way that you can use your chocolate as well so then next we have the Nutella Be Ready bars. Really, really love these. They are five and a half cents, and they were on offer again in Asda for one pound fifty. So yeah, I really, really like those. There's quite a fair bit of Nutella in them as well, and it's like a wafer bar. Um, so really, really good. I really enjoy those, and that gives you again, you know, the intense sort of, or me anyway, gives me the intense chocolate fix or hit. Um, okay, so next we have, as all Slimming World does, um, we have the um, Hi-Fi bars. So at the moment I've got the Choc Macaroon, which is coconut, and the Double Chocolate Crisp. I'm really enjoying these ones at the moment. They're one of my favourites. Um, so I'll just show you what they look like, but I'm sure you've all seen them before. Um, so this is what these ones look like. Now these are two of your healthy extra you can have them in so your healthy extra b you can have them in any combination so you could have two of the same flavor you could have um you know anything and they do lots and lots of different flavors as well you can get them in your group or you can get them online um if you're an online member so yeah i these are something that are really to me more like more like chocolate than a cereal bar if that makes sense um but yeah, or if you've used your healthy extra, you can have one of these for three sins. And I've done that before in the past. I've spent three sins on one of these because they are something that is worth it and gives you that little hit if you need it. So yeah, that's those. And I think I'm down to the last thing now. Oh no, I've got two things left. So this is one of the noisiest ones, so I'm really sorry. Let me just get them out there. So these are the drumstick squashies. So these are little mini bags. Put them in there. So they're little mini bags. They are quite small. Little mini bags. Oh, there's a glare there. That's better. So these are little mini bags of sweets. They are like um, foamy jelly sweets. Um, I love sort of gummy sweets like Haribo's and things but I can't eat them because of my jaw because they're too chewy um, but these are just the right um, sort of 
just right for me and they're so nice um they are two and a half cents per little bag um and there's just enough in there to get that sweet sort of um you know that sweet um if you've got a craving for sweetness these will do it because they are quite sweet and they've got that nice texture so yeah those are really really good i think i've seen them on other people's um you know channels and things and on instagram so yeah they are really good as well and the last thing i have yeah i'm sure this is the last thing um sorry is um, metcalf skinny popcorn in the salted caramel flavor so this one is one of my favorites i love salted caramel um and it is five and a half sins for 25 grams so it is a um, big bag which I shouldn't really get because you know I sometimes struggle to just have a portion but so far so good I've been all right on this so yeah this is really really nice and um, they do lots of different flavors you know they do um, salted they do um, sweet and salted and different things so yeah i'm sure that's everything um i didn't realize how much i actually had until i put it all together in sort of in that basket and it was overflowing but you know i suppose it's nice to have you know a variation of different things so you know i won't get bored um and you know i will probably change that about you know i change between different things i spend most of my sins on um chocolatey things like sweet things um but you know as you can see i've got a few packets of crisps in there which i have for that time when i'm really sort of fancying it which isn't very often um it's mostly sweet things um because i just have a really sweet tooth and that's the beauty of slimming world you don't have to you know you, you don't have to take those or ban those things out of your diet you can have them within your sins and you know like I said that's what I really love about it and you know I can have these and I know that right I've got this this and this that I can have later and I normally keep my sins for the evening I do have sins throughout the day like if I have syrup on my put on my pudding syrup on my breakfast you know that sins but you know throughout the day you know sometimes i will sometimes i won't i have them in my meals but most of the time i save them for the evening so i feel like i'm having you know a big treat or i'm having a little bit of you know a munch but it's all in my sins it's all controlled and you know like i said that's why i love slimming world so much not the only reason um but you know that is one of the reasons so I hope everybody enjoyed that um, I hope you found it useful maybe you found some things that you've not thought of before um, you know um, whatever it may be um, yeah so I've really enjoyed watching other people's you know there's things that I've seen and thought oh you know I really fancy that and it's something that you know I can maybe add to my shopping in the future so thank you so much to Kelly again for tagging me um like I said I really enjoyed sharing this with you I am now going to tag two people um to share with us what's in their sin bin or what they use their sins on most regularly so the first person I am going to tag is Avetka on Avetka's Slimming World Journey um it'd be really nice um Avetka if you could share with us what your um you know what you use your sins on i'd be really interested to know so it'd be brilliant if you could um if you could take part um the second person i would like to tag is um a lady called kirsty ann her channel is kirsty ann sw she's relatively new um to youtube um she does she's on a slimming world journey as well and she she is a really lovely lady and i've been catching up on her videos um over the past few days so yeah kirsty ann it would be really really nice if you would um let us know what you use your sins on um you know do you use mostly them for mostly sweet like me or do, you know do you like savory or a mixture of both you know i'd be really really interested to know so yeah I've tagged those two persons, so that's two persons, two people, <laughs> two ladies. So that's Avetka on Avetka's Living World Journey and Kirsty Ann from Kirsty Ann SW. I will leave their channels um, in the description box below. So, you know, please go over and um, see what 
they have done um done um what the uh, sort of take on this is so yeah thank you so so much for watching everybody um i know i've been a little bit rambly but <laughs> um i just wanted to make sure that i got everything in and this wasn't too long which it already is um but um yeah thank you so so much for watching everybody it really does mean a lot if you're not subscribed already why not press that button down below come along on my journey with me we can support each other along the way through the ups and the downs and everything in between so yeah it's really really nice to um have you along and you know interact in the comments i love talking to you guys um it really really does mean a lot to me so yeah i'm gonna go now put all this back in this various places and i will see you in my next one Bye everyone.